three or four people say I'm healed. stand back up for a moment.
Now sit down. Shucks, just go ahead and just play it. Some of y'all know, late last year, early this year, I've been sick. <laughs> but I am here. For real. Yeah, I'm, I am so, the difference in where I was, where I am now is night and day. I'm healed. So, let me tell y'all. Okay, this is important. So I had to do more than just claim it. To, I had to exercise. This is what I do every day. I walk for two miles. And I had to start eating differently. Are y'all hearing me? I had to let go of some of my favorite dishes. Like some chitlins with some hot sauce poured all over. Had to 
to let it go. Let the beef and steak go. Just fish and chicken. I'm preaching right now, whether y'all know it or not. To do, I had to start eating stuff I didn't like. Yes. Called vegetables. <laughs> I hate vegetables. So now I had to start eating broccoli. And String beans. Yeah, spinach. I had to sit over the plate of spinach and say, I'm strong to the finish because I eat my spinach. Eat that. And my blood pressure is down to b less than normal, well, below normal, better than normal. And my sugar diabetes is excellent. I'm trying to help somebody. Look at your neighbor and say, he's trying to help you. So uh, I'm saying this, I, I, I hadn't planned on saying this, I have a, another sermon here that I'm supposed to be preaching, but I'm preaching right now that if you eat right and exercise, you will be healed too. community is taking too many of us out of here. Now look at your neighbor and say, you got to do better. Look at your neighbor and say, Dr. Rowe, we got Dr. Rowe here. Dr. Rowe, Dr. Rowe, come here, Dr. Rowe. This is Dr. Rowe here, y'all. She came and spoke to us a few years ago. She's worshiping with us here today. Come on up here and let me talk to you for a minute. How you doing? I am outstanding. Thank you for coming to worship with us today. Thank you for having me. You know, we got the doctor in the house, y'all. Y'all welcome, Dr. Rowe. What else we need to do? Can help us. Just go ahead and take a minute, because it's obvious we're not going to get to our normal program here today. <laughs> Tell us what else we need to be doing. I want you healthy. to fill your plate up and fill your meals up with vegetables. They will literally save your life. There are chemical compounds in those vegetables and in fruits and the pigments that give them their color that will protect you from type 2 diabetes, heart disease, hypertension, strokes, and many forms of cancer. So your plate should be filled with 50%, half of it, colorful vegetables and fruit. And then finish off with small amounts of lean protein in the forms of fish, chicken, turkey, right? And you can eat some beans for protein. It's not against the law. And then I want you to drink half your weight, your body weight in water. Because it's life sustaining. Hold water. Up, hold up, hold up. Now, this, this, is, this, is, this is serious, because see, I, I, I drink, not like y'all be drinking. Uh, <laughs> so I, I thought it just meant liquid. So I, I was an addict to, um, Sun-kissed diet sodas. So don't don't say nothing. Just hold on. I'm just I'm okay. confessing my faults. Okay. 
That's all I drank was Diet Coke and Diet Sunkiss. What I didn't know is I was pouring salt into my body all day. Yes. So I stopped drinking sodas, and now all I've been drinking is water. Thank God. Thank God. Water. Yes. Water is nature's champagne. It's life-sustaining. And I'm, I'm, I'm liking water. It tastes good all of a sudden. Oh, thank God. Thank God. Add some lemon to it. Add a, add a wedge of lemon to your water because it cuts down on inflammation. So if you got aches and pains in your body, that's inflammation. Inflammation goes from aches and pains in your muscles and joints all the way to cancer. You can cut inflammation. And the final thing I want to say is that if you work at a desk, you sit for eight to 10 hours a day, get up and move one to two minutes each of those hours and cut your cancer risk in half. Wow. Yes. I have a new book. So I've got a, I've got a new book out. Okay. I'm on a mission to help a million people lose 15 million pounds this year. So the book is called Lose Your Final 15 because I want to help you to lose weight and to get healthy 15 doable pounds at a time. And you can do it. I've already helped over a half million people on the Dr. Oz show lose 5 million pounds. So I got a message from God saying if you could do that, you know, with this book, you can lose, you can help them lose 15 million pounds, mm -hmm. 15 pounds at a time. So, so I've lost, um... You're looking great. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. Yeah. Yeah. My wife, my wife told me the other day that the clothes are looking big on me now, and I'm going to have to get a whole new wardrobe. How wonderful that, that for you. That ain't going to happen. That ain't going to happen. So, um... Just by walking and changing what I'm eating, I've lost eight, I've lost nine pounds, eight or nine pounds. Wonderful, wonderful. Praise God. Where can we get that book? Where, we can, where can we get that book? Everywhere books are sold. So every bookstore, Amazon, Barnes & Noble, and all bookstores, maybe here. We don't have it here now, but we'll have it here now, I tell you. And I'm willing to come back. Hey, we got, we'll, we'll have Dr. Rowe back. Say amen. We'll have her back. Did y'all get all of that? Y'all gonna do it? Did y'all notice how I got a little softer right there? I want you to look at somebody and say, you need to do it. Go ahead, tell them you need to do it. Y'all got, that's the sermon for today. I, I don't got time to do it now. It's too late for me to hit the word I want. So let's go ahead. We're going to say, I'm going to be healed. Tell, tell somebody, I'm going to be healed. I'm going to be healed. church every Sunday and don't move nothing. You can start getting healthy right now if you would get up and just start moving something. Everybody move. Come on, let's do it to the right. Just move. Move.
Sonny O!